Hello there, it is 8.15. Um, yeah, I'm out on trail now. I've been out for maybe 30 minutes and uh, my plan for the day is to get to Goose Mountain Pond Cabin, which is only like 10 miles away. Then apparently it's a really cool spot where they have like uh, boats you can use and there's a bunkhouse and uh, other sorts of amenities and it's uh, donation based so it's I think it's mostly through hikers who use it and it should be pretty cool so I should be able to get most of the day just hanging out by the lake and all that good stuff so I'm looking forward to it All right, I'm leaving the little trail stand back there. Just got a soda, and they also had free Wi-Fi, so I was able to download some things. Uh, the service hasn't been great out here, so that was awesome. Super appreciative of that. All right, I'm out here on Upper Goose Pond over at the, uh, the cabin. They actually have canoes that we can use. So I'm out here and enjoying this beautiful day on the lake. Uh, it's really just a perfect day to be out here doing this. Really glad I took the time to um, hop off trail for a little bit and just Nero and, uh, you know, really just enjoy my time out in nature and is really great just being out here went for a swim now this it's been a very fun and very relaxing day All right, it is 6.30 in the morning here. 
I am out on trail. Uh, for what, whatever reason, I got up at 5.30 this morning and it felt like I got enough rest, so I just got up. Um, caretaker provided uh, pancakes and coffee, which is really awesome. Uh, his name is Cricket and he's a really good guy and very hospitable. So very appreciative of him and the Goose Pond Cabin for taking care of us dirty hikers. Um, he has a really great day yesterday, had a lot of fun. And my plan for today, so I'm doing another small day, 11 and a half miles over to the Cookie Lady, which um, you know, she lets hikers stay on her land. I'm, pr I'm pretty sure it's like a farm and um, I don't want to spoil too much about what it is, but it sounds pretty cool and I'm looking forward to it and it should be a lot of fun. All right, so I've made it to the cookie lady's spot. Uh, turned an old airplane hangar into a bunkhouse for through hikers, which is pretty awesome. All right, so I got this bucket here and I got to fill this up with uh, blueberries and then I will get a free meal, so. Gotta pick all these blueberries here. Halfway there. All right, I finished picking my blueberries a little bit ago. Uh, ate a nice meal uh, provided by the owners here. Um, just been relaxing and resting up, getting ready for a nice day of hiking tomorrow. Looks like a storm probably is going to be rolling in soon, so I'll probably hunker down soon. All right, looks like another rainstorm is coming in pretty soon. Um, it's around 6 p.m. Uh, I think I might call it a night soon, just relax and uh, chill. So that's about it for the day. All right, I am back on the trail. Had a really great day yesterday, picking blueberries and just hanging out. Uh, met a lot of cool hikers. So it was a lot of fun and um, would definitely recommend anyone stop by there if they're on the AT. Um, so for today, I'm gonna do 18.3 miles into the town of Cheshire and I'm gonna do a resupply in there at some point. So I'll be passing through the town of Dalton as well. And I may resupply there. I don't know, it depends. I have to do a little bit of research 
once I get some better service on uh, where I want to resupply. But um, yeah, today should be pretty chill. It's not too much up and down, so it should be a relatively quick 18.3. Um, and then uh, it looks like it may storm a little bit this afternoon, but nothing too crazy. Uh, 7.30 a.m. right now, so I got out pretty early, so I, I should get to town at a decent hour. It's 10 a.m., six and a half miles in, and it's time for a snack break. Took a dip in this little pool here, feeling nice and clean, ready to uh, hike the rest of these miles today. I'm back in the woods here. I just passed through the town of Dalton pretty quickly. Didn't stop to eat or anything. Um, yeah, I think there's going to be storms this afternoon, so I'd like to get to Cheshire as soon as possible. Got about seven and a half miles to go. Um, I'm at the beginning of a climb here. Got to climb up about a thousand feet and then be up on a ridge line for a while and then a climb down into Cheshire and um, there I'll just do a light resupply and um, just get some dinner so I'm looking forward to that and uh, feeling good today no pain no aches or anything so just been crushing the miles and feeling good it's been a good day All right, I'm going to head out here, take this bike for a spin, uh, go get some food, and then do a bit of a resupply. Good morning, I'm out here on the trail. It's around 8.30 a.m. Um, so I'm going to summit Mount Greylock today, which is the highest peak in Massachusetts, which I'm looking forward to. Uh, hopefully I get a view, I don't know. Might be locked in, which I think that's how it gets its name. Greylock, 
constantly locked in clouds. So I'm wishing that I resupplied after because my pack is super heavy and it's a pretty big climb today. So after Greylock, I'm gonna go a few more miles into a campsite. It'll be my last night in Massachusetts. So it'll be a total of 16.2 miles today, which I think will be plenty considering the big climb ahead. But overall, I'm looking forward to it. It's gonna be a great day. I've done a thousand feet of climbing and I got about 1500 more to go. I have stopped off at this shelter here and it's time for second breakfast. I think it might be time to put the rain jacket on. It's starting to get a little heavier up here. All right, there's thunder in the distance, so I'd like to be up and over the summit here, uh, which I will be. I'm pretty much there, so I don't plan on lingering up here. Just gonna keep moving. Alrighty, this was my little shelter from the storm here. Uh, it looks like it's passed. I just went and filled up my water and got a nice little view of the, uh, the tower up there, so that was cool. Um, yeah, while well, I was hanging out here to uh, escape the storm, um, met a really cool guy. His trail name is Father Time and he invited me over to his place for dinner, which is just about six miles ahead in the town of North Adams. He's right off trail. So I'm gonna go over there, have some dinner. It was really cool, and um, I look forward to it. So I'm about to get back on, out on trail now. All right, I'm almost to camp here. Uh, it's got some water from that spring there. You can actually see it bubbling up. Uh, today's been awesome, hit mile 1600. Climbed the highest peak in Massachusetts. Uh, got some trail magic. Uh, it's just been a really awesome day. I've been having a lot of fun. 